All right, EU elections coming up. What party to vote for, you might ask. Does voting even matter, you might also ask. Now to respond to the second question first. Yes, of course it matters. Everything you do, every single little thing you do in life matters and everything is interconnected. So, I'm a quite busy man myself, if I may say so. But I will have absolutely no issue at all to go to spend 30 minutes on Sunday to go to vote. So this is not to say that voting will magically change anything great overnight, but you can view it as a tug of war. So when you vote, you give our guys a push in the right direction. The right with a capital R, so in the right wing direction, of course, because you should vote for a party that will push the Overton window and the actual political framework in a um, rightward direction and in the direction of remigration, the only question that matters at this particular moment in time. Now, I'm not saying that there aren't other questions at hand that are important, but everything pales in comparison to remigration. Without remigration, Europe will cease to exist. Without remigration, we will have civil war or total collapse in a few decades, if not even earlier. So that is what's at stake, and I believe that most normal humans on Earth would view it as a great tragedy should European civilization disappear. And I'm not being dramatic, you all know what is at stake. European civilization will cease to exist unless a great remigration takes place. So do go to vote, it will not take all too much time and it is a very time effective way to help the, the good cause for European civilization. Now this is not to say that the democratic system is good, it's actually rigged in the favor of the leftist. And uh, something else to keep in mind, if the voting system, if it didn't matter, they wouldn't need to resort to underhand tactics, which they do. So do keep that in mind if you believe that voting is a waste of time, that say that to the left instead, ask them to not go to vote, but ask our guys to actually go to vote, because again, it does matter, everything matters. Now, what party to vote for, you might ask. What party will I vote for, you might ask. And I will respond to that. I will vote for the Sweden Democrats, not because I believe all of their representatives are perfect humans, not because I believe the party is perfect, not because I align 100% with all of their points. I vote for them because that is a step in the right direction, and more importantly, because I perceive in that party a possibility for good young men, sensitive young men, to come into the party to get a career in which they can push things in our direction. So the Sweden Democrats, it's not a good party as it looks today, but it can become a good party if more good, young, sensitive men come into the party, start pushing it in a good direction where they can actually talk about such a thing as large-scale remigration and many other important topics. Same thing with the EU. The EU is an abomination, let's be clear. The EU is an abomination as it looks right now. It doesn't need to be that way. The only way we can change it is actually if good parties, good individuals come in, get to the levers of power, so we don't leave the levers of power to these left-wing radicals, because then they will destroy us, which is their goal. Then they will destroy European civilization, and they are doing a good job out of it. So we need to get our guys into positions of power, otherwise we will collapse, otherwise there won't be a European civilization anymore. And also, if you are a young, sensitive man looking at this, do go into politics. Do go into politics, work on the inside, do get to positions of power. If you leave walk over in the political arena, yeah, then you will be ruled over by people who hate you, simple stuff. So, do go and vote, vote for a uh, some sort of nationalist party, it doesn't need to be perfect, you don't need to agree with everything they say, again, I'm too radical for the SD, I'm too based for them at this moment in time at least, and uh, yeah, it is what it is, I vote for them even so, because it's the best way, it's the best way forward at this particular moment in time, and I know that they can push the Overton window and actually the and the actual political framework as well in a better direction. It doesn't mean a vote will change everything. It will not change magically something overnight, something great overnight. But in the long run, it gives our guys more power to implement positive change. So do go and vote. Do go and vote for some sort of nationalist party which you believe can provide our guys with a career path so they can work professionally to save mother Europe. Because our enemies, they're working professionally, which means they get a salary from their profession and their profession is to destroy us. So you need to go in, get a profession in saving us, actually. You need to get paid full time 
to implement policies that are good for the European population. So, thank you for watching, thank you for your support. I will talk more about this later on. XXO, boom!